what both my grandmothers say, that they wouldn't want to live anywhere else. Can't imagine any better dirt to get buried in. And the stuff that is already under their feet, there's too many memories here, they tell me, to move them all to someplace new. Not now. This is the place that they raised up their children and outlived their husbands. <laughs> they tell me almost everything about the Yukon's changed at least once and they're almost six decades up there. And that all their old memories can never be renovated, just forgotten. Grandma Flo, she tells me that she is blessed because all five of her kids turned out happy and that her oldest son, he's a man of God. And if the spot on her forehead turns out to be the cancer, well then she has lived a long and lucky life. Hey, A long and lucky life. Grandma Pat, she tells me that ever since her oldest brother Bob passed away three summers ago now, she is the sole remaining of her parents' five children. She tells me the only reason she's telling me any of this at all is that all her old memories, they get just a little bit closer to a mortal. Every time there's somebody listening. Thank you. Uh -huh. That's right.